Hi, I'm David Dodge. Welcome to Green Energy Futures. Hi, my name is Dan Balaban. I'm president and CEO of GreenGate Power. Uh, GreenGate Power, we're a renewable energy developer. What we do is we take ideas for new renewable energy projects and turn them into reality. Dan Balaban is a Calgary-raised entrepreneur who worked in oil and gas and saw the environmental challenges faced by the industry firsthand. This inspired him to start GreenGate Power at a time when people were still unsure about the economics and technologies of renewable energy. We've developed the two largest operating wind energy projects uh, in the province, one of which is the largest in the country represents about a billion dollars uh, of investment that we've attracted to Alberta and provides a clean source of power to more than 200,000 homes. So the first project we developed is a project called the uh, Halkirk Wind Project. Uh, that's in uh, the county of Paint Earth, about 150 kilometers uh, east of Le uh, Red Deer. Second project we developed, which is the largest operating wind energy project in the country right now, is called the Black Spring Ridge uh, Wind Project. It's in Vulcan County, Alberta. These projects were ahead of their time. But since then, wind and solar projects have become the cheapest way to generate electricity. Alberta held a number of competitive auctions over the last couple of years for long-term contracts for, uh, for renewables. You know, wind came in at uh, under four cents a uh, kilowatt hour. You know, which really shows that, uh, you know, these projects make sense at a really uh, cost competitive price, which is, again, a great deal for Alberta consumers. Balaban won one of those auctions and is developing the 113 megawatt sterling wind project south of Lethbridge. But he also began work on solar projects. So our summertime solar resource is as good as the uh, solar resource in Florida. We're the sunshine state of the north. More than 300 years, days a year of sunshine. Uh, which makes Alberta a great place for producing electricity from the sun. 2017 was the first year that global investment in renewable energy exceeded global investment in fossil fuels. You know, so the, you know, the tipping point has changed in terms of the flow of capital. And those people that are following the trends understand that renewable energy is a phenomenal business opportunity. Greengate's Traverse Solar Project was developed in the spirit of doing the largest renewable energy projects in the country. Uh, the Traverse Solar Project's in Vulcan County, uh, Alberta. It's only a, a few kilometers north of the largest wind energy project in the country, which we also uh, developed. Uh, you know, to put that project uh, into perspective, the Traverse Solar Project, it'll consist of about 1.5 million solar panels spread over 5,000 acres of land. Um, it's uh, about a half a billion dollar uh, project and will provide a clean source of power to more than 100,000 Alberta homes. The project received regulatory approval in August, and they expect construction to start in spring 2020. He says solar is a moneymaker in Alberta. There's a uh, wholesale power market for generators to sell their power into, uh, including ourselves, and we'll receive whatever the price is for the power at the time that we produce. Solar tends to produce when we need the power the most, you know, during hot, sunny days, and that's when the power prices are the highest, uh, typically in Alberta. So solar energy produces really valuable electricity. Balaban says those who pit oil against renewables risk missing out on the greatest economic opportunity of the future. I don't think the polarization is helpful uh, to the discussion at all. Uh, you know, the oil and gas industry has been great uh, for Alberta. You know, so we should be using Alberta oil. The world needs Alberta oil. But we are going through an evolution in our energy system. We also have great renewable energy resources. And I think it's prudent for us to ensure that we're going to be prosperous for generations to come and invest in renewable energy as well. I, th I don't think it's an either or decision. I think it's an and. When Greengate's two new projects are done, the company will have been responsible for 1,000 megawatts of renewable energy capacity, about one-third of Alberta's wind and solar capacity. Learn more at greenenergyfutures.ca. For Green Energy Futures, I'm David Dodge.